Hi guys, welcome back. And this is the S Bank share news today. And this may be a tip for S Bank guys because this share has shown a momentum from 36 to 45 or maybe 44 due to this S Bank S B A chairman speech uh, regarding that we will not let down S Bank. But the main problem with S Bank regarding is that still now Q3 results are not announced. As you know, guys, we already posted a video about. Is bank they may announce Q3 results as on January 28th. The reason is because, uh, is, as you know, guys, February 7th is the meeting of EGM in order to raise the 10,000 crore amount through QAP. Various investors are also planning, like Vanguard is also planning to. I mean, Vanguard may be one of the investors, or also Franklin Templeton may be also one of the investor. But the main problem in S bank is that people now has been trading with heavy uh, types of as you can see a guys spurt in volume maybe 1 to 10 times which means that from 24th January onwards the amount of volume that is traded every day is being increased guys and as you should note that today 554,000 shares block deal was, was done at 10 am still now we don't know who the buyers are or where it was a big buyer or a big seller we don't know who it is but yesterday shareholding pattern shook our mind of yes bank guys and the yes bank latest news we have gathered today and we are going to say to you guys so if you planning to short I mean if you planning to short then the best idea would be when you see the selling volume has been increasing as you can see I will show you the selling volume so that you can have a view of it as you can see here guys so buying and selling has been the same role as you can see here the market is buying is at 12, 12 lakh 12,000 and the selling is at 13 lakh 85,000 but the main problem in S bank is that this S bank share is, is being traded heavily by retailers I mean the amount of holders which had their bank shares like SBA and Kotec which had the share already has now not having the share as you can see today guys I mean Within a period of so 57,000 shares in a minute, 1 lakh shares in a minute, and 1 lakh 50,000 shares in a minute. As you can see, on today's morning, heavy shares were being traded in Yes Bank. But people are asking me, I'm I'm holding this share at 42.85, 43, 44, 45 rupees. So what do you to say about Yes Bank? The reason what I'm going to say about Yes Bank is very very short thing, guys, because even though if they raise 10,000 crore P amount, but the Price at which they are going to rise is very very important. As per research work, we think this bank share can raise the amount at sharply at 53 rupees. They can raise the QAP price. But the main thing is that if the price is QAP at 53 rupees, it is it means it is rising less than its book value. You should know that yes bank having a book value of 106 rupees, but if you know if they raise at 53 rupees which means 50 percent they are giving discount to buyers who are coming but there are valid reasons for the QAP because because as you know the bank is being under pressure and there is no adequate capital and the profit is also not correct guys and as recently you should know that yes bank recoveries made by made from cycle logistics lanes where is being going to good and they are going recovering is very very good so now if you want to trade for an intraday as you already said guys it is 41.85 now maybe you can see for a target of around 43.45 that is the first level in the upside and if you want to trade I mean if you want to hold long it should definitely cross 44.25 so that it can be a long position holding so if you are holding in the range of 41.85 to 42 or 43 then that then your selling should be at 43.4 and the next service is that using use the buy on disk strategy which will help you a lot guys because buy on disk is a very very important because you can average your price at S bank but people are asking that we have bought at 100 we have bought at 50 or bought at 80 so that to the people my advice would be that if you want to get the share away then please don't enter in the share newly but if you want to have more shares and you want to adjust your price then my advice would be that you could average your price at this level guys because if you are holding at 100 rupees 100 shares and 40 rupees you buy then 140 your average becomes 70 rupees guys then amount of loss also comes down now this is the expand tip we are giving to you and i hope you have 
done this video because people have asked, I, I have bought bought at this level, bought at that level. So this video could give you a knowledge about that guys. I'll see you in another video very soon.